One. Hey, Eagle fans, it's Ray Simmons for GoUSIEagles.com, and we're here with head coach Chrissy Engelbecker of the women's soccer team. Chrissy, uh, great, pretty good start to the uh, conference season, one and one. Uh, talk a little bit about the, the match with the Illinois Springfield on the road. Yeah, I mean, you have to be excited when you win on the road in the GLBC uh, because it's always tough no matter where you go. So to win in overtime was exciting, and then and the girls, you know, um, they played well. Tough match on Sunday for the home opener. We lose in overtime again, or, you know, I mean, four overtime matches to start the year. Uh, what were some positives out of the overtime loss uh, against uh, McKendry? You know, I, I felt like we played hard and we played well. We just had some lapses. Um, you know, I think the four overtimes in a row kind of took its toll on us. Um, but, you know, now we're, we're back at it. The girls are ready to go for the weekend, and we're looking forward to S&T and Drury. What, what can you tell us about S&T and Drury uh, for the fans that are going to be out here at Strasweg Field on uh, Friday night and Sunday? You know, they'll be just like the, the first two GLBC games. They're going to be physical and tense, and they're going to be exciting to watch. Uh, what, can, what, what do we have to do to uh, get the positive outcomes against these two teams? You know, we're creating our chances. Now we just have to finish them. Um, I thought we had some, we had more than a handful of chances to win the game against McKendry. So we just have to kind of tighten up things and finish it when we get our chances. Well, Eagle fans, USI is back in action at Strasweg Field on Friday night at 5 o'clock when they take on Missouri S&T. And then we finish up with the homestand on Sunday when we play Drury, and that's a noon start. That's all for now, Eagle fans. This has been Ray Simmons for GoUSIEagles.com.